Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be about lashes. I did a try on style because I think those are more helpful. I like when I see people try on lashes instead of showing a box of lashes because I don't know how they look on my eyes. I don't know how they look on your eyes if I'm watching your video. So I just decided to do a try on style. I also tried on my glasses because I like to see if my lashes are going to be clashing with my glasses. You guys know I wear my glasses every day. I don't have contact and I'm also going to be showing you my favorites and the brand that I'm mostly using is Kiss. I love Kiss as a brand. I used to buy their little um, press on nails, the French Kiss and I used to put them on when I was in like middle school. <laughs> so let's get on to the video. The first pair of lashes I'm going to be showing you guys is this Lash Couture by Kiss. Um, this is the Fox Mink collection in the little black dress. This is very nice. Um, I don't know if I love these lashes yet because they're so short on me. I mean, they are perfect if you have glasses because you're going to see. I tried them on and they don't clash on my glasses, but they're so short. I made some notes on my phone here of what I think about the lashes. And for my cons for the Kiss Lash Couture is I can feel them on my lashes. Like I think they're not super heavy. But I could see them, you know, like when you see them on your lashes, like sitting on your lashes, that's how I feel. And they have a thick band. Uh, they're not flexible because, like, you try to move them around and they do move, but then it goes back to their straight, thick band. <laughs> My pros is it's somewhat natural. Um, I think it's not, like, super 100% natural. You could tell that they're false lashes, but they're not overpowering on the eyes. All these lashes are affordable, so that's a pro on its own. They're short enough for you to wear your glasses. The second pair I'm going to show you guys is this Look So Natural by Kiss. Um, I'm not in love with this either. They're, they're pretty comfortable, they are but the band is very flimsy. It's too flexible. Like the other one, um, the other one was not flexible, but this one is too flexible. For my con, I said too flexible, flimsy. My pro is it's pretty <laughs> um, natural. Cause they are pretty naturalish looking but they're not too natural. The next one is this Ardell Natural Lash. This is a 110. Do not get confused with a 120. I think that one is a Demi Wispy. This one is just a Wispy. These are super natural looking. They really are. Um, these were my favorite lashes for a long time. And for the pro is lightweight, easy to apply, thin band, but not flimsy. It is perfect. Um, it's wearable, so if you don't want to, I think this is the perfect lash if you don't want to wear any makeup, but you want to wear a lash. The next ones are two from the same collection, but two different styles. This one is Lily, and this one is Daisy. So let's talk about Daisy really fast. This one reminds me so much of Shy from the Look So Natural. The way that their bands are, same. They're the same. I don't know. Like, they feel, like, too flimsy. But these are so pretty. Like, the, the daisy ones, they're very pretty. But it's pretty hard for me to apply them. And I apply lashes, like, average. I don't wear lashes every single day. But I'm not a beginner anymore. And I've had two different um daisies if you apply them perfectly like without messing up they're very pretty but if you make a little mistake i don't know they overlap each other maybe you're gonna be able to see it on the side clip but lily is so pretty um it's not hard to apply at all it's pretty much the same thing as the ardell except this one is a little bit more dramatic it's not as natural but it's still pretty natural um you cannot go wrong with lily it's so pretty and peony peony pony peony is another daisy that one is more dramatic and is the same thing except it's worse it's worse than daisy so you choose i mean it depends on what you want from your lashes because for me 
I don't want to fight with my lashes. I just want them to stay on my eyes. And that's it. <laughs> the pros for my Lily is wearable, easy to apply, flirty, natural looking. <laughs> you don't need makeup to make it work. Um, and it's glass friendly. I love the Lily Lash. It's not too dramatic, but it gives you a little extra for your lashes and it's the best. I love it. This is highly recommended by me. And the last one is this Kiss Ever Easy Lash in the style 11. It's the one that I'm wearing right now and I fell in love. Oh my goodness, I do not like dramatic lashes. And when I saw them, I was like, I, I'm i not gonna like this at all. I'm not gonna like them. And I was like, okay, but I'm gonna try it anyways because I bought it. <laughs> These lashes are the only ones that I did not have to trim. And they're beautiful, oh my goodness. But they are not glass friendly. They're not glasses friendly, they're not. They're so beautiful, like, they're dramatic, but they're not too dramatic. I first tried these on my other video, the red eye shadow not the eyeball <laughs> um and i was like oh, i'm not gonna like these because they're curly they're dramatic they're pretty much everything i don't like <laughs> yet i bought them right they're dramatic but they're not too dramatic they don't take over your eyelid because that's why i don't like curly lashes because i feel like they're gonna take over my eyelid space but i tried them on and they are so beautiful like they're comfortable like i don't even feel them I don't feel them. So I am loving them. Especially because I did not have to trim them. Because you know like sometimes you buy lashes and then you trim too much and you're like, damn it. What am I going to do now? <laughs> these three are my favorites. If I have these three, then I'm not going to need any other lashes. I mean, I'm going to buy more because I have no self-control. <laughs> but they're so nice. They're comfortable. They're affordable. And honestly, I had this Lily Lash for like a year. Or about to be a year. I take care of them. I just, you know, like sanitize them and stuff like that. And I don't wear them as much. But I make sure that whenever I take off the glue, I am very careful. So this is the end of the video. Hope you guys liked it. Um, I hope that it was helpful for you guys. And if you guys have any questions, just let me know. And I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!